you know, I was really hoping that my Walmart would get more light of destruction, and they did. Let's get into it. Alright, so I went to Walmart the other day and was hoping to find something fun. And not only did they have like 20 plus boxes of uh, retro pack reprint, but they also had a small amount of light of destruction. Now, I only went in and spent $100. So I got five boxes, but um, let's see what we can get out of these. Uh, hopefully, the rest of the Light of Destruction boxes will be there when I get back. Now, luckily, my Walmart typically goes more or less unscathed for Yu-Gi-Oh! and Magic Product. Well, Magic Product, I can't say so much. But let's see if we can get any ultimates, ghosts, secrets. Hell, even an ultra today. Why not? That's probably going to be some editing that I'll do. As long as this shit stays focused, we are good. Alright, first few boxes that I open. Kind of doo doo. A little bit of ass. But we'll see what we got to day. Oh. And it's like, uh, it's like it, it's saying sorry. So we're going to start off with a beautiful, honest, secret rare. Nice. Good way to start considering um, what the other mini boxes were pulling like. Alright, so we're already starting off with a secret rare. Fantastic. Oh. We got Arcus, the Light Sworn Druid for a super. Okay, so we got two foils out of that mini box. Beautiful. I'm pretty sure people want these frogs. Yo, can we make it three for three? And as usual, I hope everybody's having a good day today. And Destruction Jammer. Or rare. Somebody else on Whatnot was asking for some white cards. I'm probably, I should probably set that aside. Which, by the way, we also have a... What we? I have a Whatnot channel. Same thing. Hatchet Gaming. Go give it a follow. Check it out. Hopefully I have some stuff that you're looking for. And along with this nimble Musabi and whatnot. Also check out the TCG player sh uh, shop. Box number two. I think there was at least a good Four to six boxes left um, that I left on the shelf. Looks like these are some good choices. All right, show me a foil. Beautiful. Divine Knight Ishark. Ishark. Any monster that this card destroys by battle is removed from play. Interesting. Where they started using the word banishment. Mm -hmm. Bunch of Arcana Force. And battery man industrial strength. And I'm also thinking I'm I'm definitely liking this uh this lighting much better than I liked on the last video already. Cup of ace. 
And secret number two. Ben, freaking tastic. We got Fog King. All right. So, two mini boxes, two secrets. Good stuff. Good stuff. Show me a ghost or an ulti. Destiny hero stuff. Onir's seal. In retrospect, never fucking mind. Not as I was getting, as good as I was thinking. First, I was like, oh, like a giant or heavy true name for monsters. No, let's look. Oh, and if you guys stay till the end, I will get to show you all a fun, beautiful item that I got from the boys over at Millennium Rares and whatnot. I uh, won it on one of their wheel games. Yeah, it's probably going to be the new home for my Exodia pieces. The Exodia binder. And then we got another super gladiator beast, Geyserus. You know, these mini boxes are behaving much better than the first handful that we've opened so far. Volcanic Queen. Mm -hmm. And a rare Arcana Force 14, Temperance. All right. This should be a fairly quick video. Mm. And a rare Flame Spirit Ignis. whole bunch of unifrog commons too. Well, if somebody asks on whatnot if I have any frogs, I can't say no anymore, that's for sure. Let's pack out of this mini box. Do you have something good? We haven't seen Hero Mask yet. Okay, well we got another super light of redemption, that's pretty. Add from. Well, add one of your remove from play light monsters to your hand. Hmm. Would be a fun little generic card just to get something back. I'm guessing it goes with all this light sworn stuff. Alright, box number three. And, uh. While this. These openings are never for profit. Do you think I'm going to so far? At least with what we've seen? I will get to find that out. During the edit. Mm -hmm. Alright. Another hero mask. And another owner seal. Not a strong start, box number four. Those packs really don't fly well. Fly well. Don't have a very good weight. Oh. Hey, all right. So now we have a ultra rare super ancient dino beast. Beautiful. Okay, first ultra out of these boxes so far. We definitely take those. Let's see that ghost. 
Definitely one of my favorite rarities out of the Yu-Gi-Oh! Rarity printings. And a super rare duck uh, Ducker mobile cannon. Still, still better than all the boxes I opened before this video. We got one more to go. And a ugly. That has got to be one of the ugliest dragons I've ever seen. Look at him. He's just... And nah, that's not it. But it's still ultra rare, so. Like I said, man, we take that shit. Mm. Does he even have a good effect? Alright, so what we got here. Uh, when your opponent special summons a monster, you can special summon this card from your hand. Two of your monster zones cannot be used. Yeah, screw that. the hell is that about? Yeah, let's just catch Tira myself, why don't we? Now the wrapping on this box is fucking hella thick. Now, the boxing definitely throws nice. Packs atrocious. Yeah, they don't even want to, like, look out. Mm -mm -mm. And another min uh, nimble Musabi. Rip. And I still haven't even gotten... My uh, my weekly Legend of Blue Eyes box yet? That's uh, something I'm gonna have to get this week. Hello, Trice Magistus, this weekend. Interesting looking super rare. Oh, and it's a pyro, a light pyro. Mm, you gotta tribute some. Ah, uh, no, no thanks. Set of owner seal now. Hmm. Last pack out of the last box. Hmm. And a rare for the last one. Maniacal servant. Ouch. Yeah, that last box. Rude. God, this thing is ugly. Who drew this? Shame on you. Making such ugly dragons. That is not okay. Right. And before I forget, let me show you guys. From Millennium Rares on Whatnot. I was playing a wheel game that they had, and I won this lovely, I think it's a four page uh, binder. And look at that, all of that gold inlay, tooled, whatever, that fucking pleather that shit is. Uh, but this, ladies and gentlemen, is going to be the new home for all of my Exodia pieces. Welcome to your new homeboys. I'll probably have a video of that, actually. And, uh, actually, you know what? Yeah, so actually the next video is probably going to be uh, me um, filling that binder up with all of my Exodia pieces and 
assembling this fun little guy. I believe he is the pot of extravagance. Also one from a whatnot channel. And so, see you then. <laughs>